Where do you stand after watching that clip with Eileen and Maddie? Where do I... What is up everyone? My name is Owen Holt and you already know what this is. This is Awesomeness TV's Vibe Room, the show where we spill all the tea with your favorite ATV cast members and influencers. And today I am being joined by some A&I faves. Please welcome Eddie Preciado and Jake Clark. Welcome back. Oh, what's up, brother? Dude. Thank you, know what? you for having us. It's been a minute. It is. It's, it's been, been a minute. I missed you guys. I missed you. How have we all been? I've been good. Got a new house, you know, chilling. Got to hang out with Jake a little. I've seen you out there a while. I've you seen know? you around a little bit. <laughs> what about you, Jake? What have you been up to? Oh, dude, I'm so sorry. Jake, oh, I'm good. Can I wear that hat? You want to, which, the cowboy one? Yeah. You want to wear the cowboy hat? Ah, let's wear it. Ah, here you go. No, yeah. it's okay. Sideways. Now, it has been a minute, like I said, since you guys have actually been here. And even though, Jake, you haven't been here in a while, You've been involved in the vibe room. That's right. You got brought up by Eileen and Maddie when that whole thing went down. But to save you some time, let's take a look and roll the clip. What are you f***ing saying? F are you just mad because I can get Jake and you can't? Oh! Oh, no. she's not. She's no. not. Guys, break no. it up. I've I been waiting for her to be in LA. She's in my face Eileen. right now. Say something. Jake texts me every day. He calls me every day. When does he ever text you? Okay, but did you hook up with him? Whoa! Holy <laughs> cow! Jake, okay, that was, first of all, a lot to take in. Second of all, where do you stand after watching that clip with Eileen and Maddie? Where do I... Well, they're both great friends of mine. And they have always been just friends. And nothing more than friends. <laughs> no, no. Eileen and Maddie are two incredible and hilarious people. We are just friends. That is, like... As Eileen would say, not hilarious. Hilaire. Hilaire. Yes. Shout out to you, Maddie and Eileen. I love you both. You guys are awesome. Okay, so one thing I've been dying to know is, are you two still friends with the a &I cast members? Everyone lives such busy lives, for sure. Mm -hmm. Like, everyone's off doing their own thing, which is all I could ever hope for, for everyone on the show. No, I'm gonna keep it real. I haven't talked to any of them. So is there anything that you guys have been working on since the show that we need to know about? Jake, I know you're a musician. Do you have any new projects, like yes. songs coming out? Yes. Is that a yes? Yes. Tell me no about them. Way. I have a, song, have a song coming out next month. I'm super what is the title? What excited. Is the title is, it's called Dark, Dark Circles. Circles. Show me a music video for it. It's gonna be lots of fun. Music. You're gonna have a music video? Yeah. And I think I'm allowed to say this, but I was on Wipeout. <laughs> you were and, on oh, Wipeout? Oh, yeah, and that's really coming funny. out uh, in March, so a while away, but. Jake, that's really cool, but Eddie, do you have anything that you've been working on since the um, show? Well, I just got a new house. Woo uh, woo! A new content right. house, Breezy Boys. Shout out to Breezy Boys. I love me and my <laughs> crew, you know. Uh, we have a lot of things planned uh, in the future. Right now, we have some cool things coming up. Can't yeah. say yet. Can't say yet. So excited. You guys will know soon. That's pretty cool. We moved into the new house. I've seen yeah. pictures of it and videos. Eddie, mm -hmm. it looks so cool. You already know I'm nice. coming over. Of course, brother. You guys are you guys are all welcome. You guys are all welcome. Yeah. While we're here, I think it's time to get into our first game of the day. Let's do it. It's Ready? called the ATV Homework Hotline. Woo! Homework. No. Well, it is the fall, which means we are all back in school. Jake, you're in college. I'm in college. Eddie. <laughs> F no, <laughs> trust me when I say you're gonna wanna win this oh one because the winner of this challenge will get to post whatever they want on the loser's Instagram story. Oh, okay. Wait, what? So that's why I said trust me, you're oh, gonna wanna win this one. You guys actually next to your beanbag chairs have boards, so why don't we pick them up? Oh, without any further ado, let's get started. Let's Game show it. Owen, presents. Oh. Ready, first question. What year was YouTube created? I studied before I came. All right, flip in three, two, one. I just put my year because I'm special. Is you it, guys were both way off. The two, correct answer is 2005. Is no, dang it. Moving on. <laughs> <laughs> what animal's urine glows under UV light? Five seconds. Five, four, <sighs> two, one. Flip. I thought you had said European dog. Ooh. I put a dog, fox. You put dog, you See, put See, that's what I meant, like their cousins, dog and fox or something. So I think- So that's what you, are you sure you want to switch your answer to fox? Just kidding, what's the answer? 
The correct answer is cat. You're in. Oh. So, so close. The score is still 0-0. Zero, zero. Let's see who's going to no. get the first point. Is it with this question? This question is, what is the 50th state to join the U.S.? Oh, three, two, one, flip. Florida from Eddie and Hawaii from Jake. So I'm not too big on the states. All I know is like California, Las Vegas and all that. Uh, so I put Florida because- Las Vegas I, a state? I mean Nevada or Nevada, yeah. So is Hawaii a state you asked? The correct answer is yes. And that is also the correct answer on this question. <laughs> Am I losing? You are losing by one point, but don't oh, worry, you did <laughs> some ground to make up, Eddie. Eddie. The Instagram score is stories. zero to one. When was the first Hype House created? Give me the month and year. And if you get them both correct, you get another we, point. Oh, so Flip in three, two, one. Ooh, so Eddie, you put January 2018. Jake put 2019, February. The correct answer is December 2019. So oh, you don't get a point. Woo! Jake gets a point. Wait, for getting what? the year correct, even though he didn't get the month. What pop star created the hit song TikTok in 2009, completely unrelated to the app? All right, both have your answers. We'll flip in three, two, one. Oh, you did the whole ass and everything. The correct answer is Kesha. Even though you didn't have a dollar sign, we are giving you the point, Eddie. <laughs> great job, Jake, great job. True or false? You can lick your own elbow. True or false? And flip. Is that a T or is that an What's F? What's the answer? It's, a, it's the answer. Is that a T or an F? <laughs> he combined them. Did he combine them? <laughs> <laughs> no, I did it on test. That's how I passed. That's no, what? no, no. He put no, your... wait. It's false. You can't lick your thing. <laughs> it's obvious you can't lick. But I'll take the I'll take the L because that's what I get. Jake put false. Well, the correct answer is false. Most people cannot do this. Can yeah. you guys try to do it? <laughs> oh, I think I can. I can easily. Ooh. Wait, oh, he's can't... so close. <laughs> oh, I can't. You got to twist the good old... Dude, I'm about to break. Next question. Listen up. What's the strongest bone in Eddie's body? What? Y'all know the answer. Flip your board in three, two, one, show! I don't know. You, Wait. you just left it blank. Wait, I didn't Well, the correct answer was femur. Woo! <laughs> How long on average do Americans spend on the toilet a day? This is me, so I'll give y'all mine. Three, two, one, flip. 35 <gasps> minutes, 35 minutes. Well, the correct answer was 30 minutes. Uh, it was 30, not 35, it was 30 minutes. And that was our last question, which means Jake is Woo! our winner. Um, and Eddie, I'm sorry, but you know what that means. Hand over the phone, give it to Jake. Jake gets to thinking and post whatever you want on Eddie's story, bruh. Hey guys, Jake here. Um, Eddie is in the bathroom right now. Let's just say things are getting intense, but don't worry, he's gonna be okay. Um, he'll be back soon. I'm <laughs> <laughs> gonna be like, what happened? My mom's gonna call me. What happened? I'm like, that's it. Catch. And then just save it. All just right, it's up. <laughs> Eddie, thanks for being a good sport. Ooh, I hope ooh. you guys at home got your questions answered. Anyways, now it is time for our trending topic of the day. I don't know how much you guys are into scary stuff, especially like real scary stuff, mm -hmm. but recently a huge trend has been going around about the crime side of TikTok. Most of us have just been trying to stay informed, but low key, some of us are becoming internet sleuths. And I really wanna know if you guys have ever tried to solve an internet crime on TikTok, so. Let's discuss. I've seen on TikTok, like, uh, there's this one lady that um, she films her cleaning up all, like, the crime scenes or I've whatever. seen that, too. And I, I watched it, and I was like, this is, like, I mean, it's not cool. But I Sometimes mean, like, they clean the like, toilets yeah, for, like, a few hours. Yeah, and, like, the things that they do, it's like, holy shit, like, I would never do that. Mm -hmm. Do you guys think the internet has become super obsessed with online cases? My For You page has, like, just, like, weird, like, frogs and stuff a lot of the time. But, like, I, I once in a while, I've, like, stumbled upon like crime videos and obviously there's that like couch guy like where people couch are, like trying. Talk. Yeah, who is that couch guy? You I don't know, but I feel guy. like, I don't know. I feel like sometimes we get too involved with people's personal lives. Do you think there's any negatives to having so much information out on the internet? Yeah. I feel like with everything, like there's definitely like positives 
and negatives and I feel like you know in like in the example of crimes like a positive is like it brings awareness mm -hmm. you know but like a negative is like you could be spreading like misinformation it was really cool to hear your insight on some of these crime solving internet things going around it's anyways fun. it is time for my favorite part of the day say it with me three two, two one, one. Fan fan questions. Questions. questions that's right you guys yeah. so we asked you guys to give us questions to ask eddie and jake and boy, did they deliver. So did let's they? get right into it. <laughs> Woo! Darcy wants to know, and this is for both of you, what made you want to participate on season two of Austin is TV's Next Influencer? Uh, I just wanted to go for the experience. You know, I wanted to be on a reality TV mm. show, see how it is with a group of like people I don't know. Uh, I guess uh, same, I just like, Thought it would be a fun experience like to put myself out there a little more. This next question is from Savannah, and Savannah asked, is Jake still talking to Maddie? Because we all know how Maddie feels, but how does Jake feel? Uh, me and Maddie, yeah, we definitely still stay in touch. Uh, we'll like text each other once in a while, FaceTime once in a while. Ooh. But no, no, but we're just like, like I said, we're really good friends, seriously. Okay, <laughs> now this next question is from Home Law, and they asked, were you both surprised to watch the show back and hear what everyone was saying behind your back? I didn't expect it from like my friends that I had made on there and then like talking behind my back and like saying that stuff, but I don't really. I don't okay, care. okay, word, yeah. There were definitely, you know, things that were shocking, but for the most part, you know, we're on a reality show. Well, thank you, Home Law, for asking that question. Be sure to get in the conversation, and your question might end up right here on the Vibe Room. Well, finally, it is time for our last game, and since it's Halloween time, I thought we should play Pop My Pumpkin! Woo! Woo! Look at all these! Hey! Oh, 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 oh! Oh, they got oh, questions hey. in them? That is right, so if you look closely, and here, there are questions inside of these balloons. Sorry, pumpkins. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take this needle and then pick a pumpkin that you wanna pop, pick out the question, read it out loud, and we'll go from there. I really hate popping balloons. I really do, like it's scary as You wanna go first? No. All right, Jake, Eddie declined going first, which means you can grab this needle and pick a balloon and we can get started. Let's do this. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, I wanna do this one. That wasn't bad. He's gonna pick. Mm, what's your first date horror story? Uh, one time in, um, I think it was ninth grade, ninth or 10th grade, um, I went ice skating with this girl um, and it was just really awkward um, the whole time. You know, it's just, it wasn't there. <laughs> Good, hey, it wasn't bad. Anyways. Hey, thank you, Woo! Jake, coming up for two. Ooh, Whoa, yeah, yeah, go. I gotta go. Uh -huh. Eddie means I you hate... know what to do next. <laughs> Please, bro, bro. I hate, like, I really can't. Oh, dang it. Ooh, ah, that was scary. Okay. If you could put on a curse on anyone, who would it be? Well, I'm not that mean of a person, and I would never do that. I would put, I would never put a curse on anyone, ever. But my friend doesn't believe, back home, he doesn't believe on, like, ghosts or anything. So I'd probably put, like, a little ghost curse on him. Ooh. Just see, so he could experience the ghost. And, Maybe, like, yeah. whenever he's home alone. Yeah. Just have a little noise. Like a little scare or a little something. scare you know? action going. Yeah. I like that. Jake, it is back to you. Oh, you got to pop another one, dude. Yes. Oh, no. <laughs> Ooh. Let's read it out loud this time. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you get? Um, have you ever ghosted anyone and why? <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> You're getting all the low shit, <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes I do it on accident. Like, I, I am, like, not a good responder sometimes. So it's like, I'll, like, read text messages, and then I'll be in the middle of doing something. Yeah. And then I never respond for, like, yeah. two, like a week or something. And I'm like, oh, my gosh, I'm an awful person. And then I text them, like, oh, my gosh, I'm so yeah, sorry. Yeah, I've and then they just leave you on red firsthand yeah. when we were supposed to go to a concert. Cool. Uh, so let's not get into that. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, and then Eddie, it's your turn. Go <gasps> <This is> <laughs> Dude. <laughs> I swear, I'm like, this is probably, this scares me. Jake? What's your biggest fear in life? Heights. I can't do that. 
Are you sure it's not oh. popping these pumpkins? Oh, well, this too. I'm scared of heights. Like flying, and when I fly by myself and all that, I don't even look out the window. I'm, like, I'm glad I don't get a window seat. So you get an aisle seat? Uh, oh, yeah. So I don't have to either middle that. Really? Yeah. What's like, your biggest fear, Owen? My biggest fear? Yeah. My biggest fear, Jake, is ending the vibe room. And I'm not going to lie, it is that time. No. Oh. Yes. Oh, I it's going to be like, Owen's like, ah. I know I'm really sorry, but that does conclude our time here today in the Vibe Room. Well, I'm glad you guys both had fun, and I'm glad you guys stuck around. If you enjoyed and you haven't already, give this video a big thumbs up and a subscribe if you haven't already, please. Also, so you don't miss another Vibe Room episode, hit that bell so you get notified every time we get a Vibe Room episode that comes out and every time that a new Austinist TV mm. video comes out. Trust me, they're getting really good. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Owen Holt. And I'm Eddie Preciado. And I'm Jake Clark. And you're watching Austinist TV's Vibe, Vibe Room. Woo! Bye. Woo! Eddie, how did you feel watching that back? I need to watch what I say on this. Shit. I really have to. She wishes. <laughs>